how to litter train your guinea pigs. So, when litter training guinea pigs, they don't, they're not going to be 100% like a rabbit would be if you have them spayed or neutered. They're going to have accidents, they're going to pee outside the litter box, and obviously poo everywhere, but the, the majority of their mess is captured in the litter box and it makes it much easier to clean the cage, and the cage ends up looking much nicer. So, so if you're going to do this, all you're going to need is a cat-sized litter box that is fairly short, no larger than like five inches. They might not be able to jump over that. It has to be very fairly large, so there's plenty of room for them to do their mess. Next thing you're going to need is some litter in their thing. You cannot use cat litter. You cannot, because it's can cause them respiratory infections because it's too grainy. You can do not use um, any cedar or um, cedar or pine, whoops, no, cedar litter. You can, you can also, instead of litter, you can also use Carefresh, but you'd be going through a lot of it because it's not very absorbent. You, and you can also use aspen bedding, not pine or cedar as it is dangerous and again can cause respiratory infections. So, I just use this pelleted pine bedding. It is safe, even though it's pine, because it's processed differently. And um, I get this from Tractor Supply. It is pretty cheap, $5 for this big bag, and it's very absorbent. So, this is what I use for, it says on the box for horses, cats, and rabbits, but for horses and small animals, it works great. This is what I use for all of my animals, including the guinea pigs and our hamster. No, and, and a rabbit. Sorry, I can't speak today. So, yeah. We're gonna need some hay. The hay does not need to be... Girls! The hay does not need to be top quality hay as um, it will end up being peed on. Probably not eaten. So, I have this hay that I got at Tractor Supply. I just wanted to point out, it says recommended for rabbits, guinea pigs, chinchillas, and hamsters. Hamsters are herbivores and do not eat hay, especially not Timothy, so do not give your hamster Timothy at all. Next thing you're going to need is some newspaper to line the bottom of your litter pan for extra absorbency. The very last thing you're going to need is a scoop for cleaning. So let's get into it. You're going to want to start by lining your litter box with a layer of a newspaper. So I just go like this and then take another one and go there. And you're just gonna line you just gonna want to cover it, cover the newspaper with your litter or bedding as like that, but make do about an inch through an inch half an inch throughout the entire thing. All you're gonna do is take a thin layer of your not so good quality hay and cover the top just for a layer of extra absorb it's extra absorbance layer. They do sometimes eat this hay, but it's not dangerous, it's just there to also entice them to go into it. Like it would be in the wild. And the very last thing you're going to want to do is place this in your cage right under the hay. Which this one's supposed to be filled with. And there you go. That's pretty much it. There's nothing else you need to do to make them use it to go in the bathroom other than putting their food in there and then guinea pigs poop when they're eating, so when they're eating all their hay, pellets and veggies aren't really necessary to put in there, but if you'd like to, you can. When they're eating their hay, they poop, and then they'll go back to that spot to poop and pee, because it's like their bathroom. That's basically all you need to do. It's super simple, but it does take time, so be patient. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful. It really helps keep your cage clean. When before we litter trained, at first, um, they were 
pooping and peeing everywhere and we had to clean the cage every single day. It was insane and it was a lot of work and it was not fun until I found out you can litter train them and we tried and now we only have to clean it every three to four days. So hope this helped and make sure to like, comment, and subscribe and I will see you guys next time. Bye! Thank <laughs> you.